good morning. For, <laughs> for years I've been dying to get a bit of my beloved Deep Purple into this Connect Up video and today I've succeeded. We heard there the opening uh, few uh, bars of Space Trucket and the reason uh, that we hit on that piece of music is because the opener to today's Connect Up is entitled Pale Blue Dot, that is Planet Earth. So have a look at that. It's all tied in with Thomas Traherne, priest and poet and arch wanderer. A little bit of Albert Einstein, Carl Sagan, um, you name it, it's all contained in our opening lead and the whole business of being full of wonder. Uh, so I won't say any more. Um, Oh, except to say that it uh, also brings in uh, NASA's mission to Europa, one of Jupiter's icy moons. It's a bit like an icy moon in here this morning. We've got no fire on and it's jolly cold. Well, at the end so, of a couple of weeks when we've been treated <clears> with, you know, the northern lights and the comet, oh, yeah. we won't see again for 8,000 years. Good point. Whatever it was, yeah. It all ties in very nicely, doesn't yeah, it? Does, with the space doesn't it? Theme. it does. Yeah, so anyway, that's enough of uh, extraterrestrial stuff. <laughs> Over to the terrestrial. Although, actually, uh, what you're about to talk about does take us to heaven, doesn't well, it? Well, yes, in a way. Yes. <clears throat> so, tomorrow's worship. Uh, you'll find a complete list of tomorrow's worship in Connect Up as usual. But we'd draw your attention particularly to what's happening uh, tomorrow in terms of choral evensong. And you got the title right there. Well done. I did. There will be two services of choral evensong in our benefits tomorrow. One at Tenterden Church and another at Wittersham. Both begin at 6pm. Now, the Wittsham one will be led by our wonderful church choir over there, and um, the one at Tenterden will be accompanied by the Tongswood Chamber Choir. So, if you fancy either of those, do come along uh, to Choral Evensong tomorrow, either at Wittsham or at Tenterden. Good. Now, two forthcoming events for your calendar. The concert recital by Paul Edmund Davis, world-renowned flautist. Now, apparently he played on... Uh, did somebody say he played on the Star Trek films and Harry Potter? Yes, Something and it's like been that. involved. Well, he was part of the um, London Symphony Orchestra, wasn't he? So, oh, yes, yeah, the well. London <laughs> Symphony Orchestra have done all kinds of wonderful film scores and things over the years. So, yes, I think hmm. um, Eleanor was saying that he was part of yeah, Harry Potter theme and played yeah. on Star Wars, all that kind of there stuff. There you go. So, anyway, he's coming to Tenterden, and we're jolly, jolly lucky. Uh, it'll be on 16th of November, starting at half past two, doors open at two. Wonderful music, great stories, he's a great raconteur, and uh, tea and cake as well, all for £15. Tickets available from Webbs, um, which is probably the easiest, or if you're in church at St Mildred's on Sunday, see Mary Moncton or Eleanor Bliss. Fantastic. And then, uh, if that weren't enough, uh, Sutton Valance Choral Society will be performing John Rutter's Requiem and Carl Jenkins's The Armed Man, A Mass for Peace. 23rd of November, 7 o'clock. And uh, Webs are people to go to for tickets uh, for that. That's a tenth okay. of Yeah, great, isn't it? Uh, we're marching on through uh, the month. Actually, we're marching on through the year. I hardly we believe are. it, really. But uh, given the fact that we're now uh, over halfway through this month, um, we better start looking at what happens at the start of next. So uh, we focus on cappuccinos and pie and pint. Cappuccinos uh, takes place on the first Saturday of the month and pie and pint takes place on the first Monday of the month, um, both in the Vine Inn. So if you're interested in either of those, you can find the details in Connect Up and get in touch with us if you'd like to come along. Yes, now I'm going to jump things slightly uh, to services of light because... Mm. Um, We've got three services of light this year, one at Wittersham Church on Sunday the 27th of October, one at Tenterden Church on Sunday the 3rd of November, and one at Rolvenden Church on Sunday the 24th of November. At these services we're going to remember all those who have died since last year's services of light, whose funerals we have taken, together with others whose remembrance has been requested. Now, uh, there's some quite precise instructions about uh, how names uh, will be remembered at those services. So please, please, please do look at Connect Up, either in the paper form or the uh, digital form, and there you'll find all the instructions you need. And if you would like someone to be remembered by name at any of those services, 
then we'd be delighted to hear from you. Okay. Uh, can we recap yes. um, some of the upcoming meetings to do with Good idea. Uh, the single parish? Uh, we've been mentioning this a lot recently, but uh, it's really, really important that we have everyone involved um, in this process because really it affects all of us in some way, um, but it's really to do with how we govern our churches. Um, we've got some presentations coming up over the course of November, um, which will take place in all of our parishes. And it's to look at changes in how we might be able to better manage and better govern um, our parishes, our, our churches at the moment, um, with the prospect of becoming one single parish. So please, if you're interested or you have any questions at all, make sure that you can come to at least one of these uh, presentations. I did have someone say to me the other day, is it okay if I come to several? And I said, well, it's more than okay to come to, to several. Yes. And um, the benefit of that, of course, is the fact that not well, every you, question... <laughs> <laughs> not every question that gets asked at one will get asked at another. No, that's so clear, if you yeah. want a really broad sort of, uh, you know, and the questions that get asked in what is currently one of our parishes, mm. um, because of their context and their situation, might not get asked to, uh, at another. So, um, do come along, find out more, and ask some questions because um, this is this is about us as a church family together. Yeah, yeah, that's a good point. I haven't thought of that. Different questions at different mm. venues. Yeah, although the presentations are same, the questions, of course, will be different. Um, or could be. Uh, now, are you new to Tenston Church? And uh, by new, we may mean anyone who feels new. If so, come along to our coffee and cake welcome morning in Tenston Church, Saturday the 26th of October from 10 till noon, and find out a little bit more about our church community at Tenton. Uh The cake would be worth coming to, if not the presentation. <laughs> Only joking. Presentation will be wonderful too. Right uh, now, I can dispense with that sheet and that sheet. All oh, we're working through nicely. Um, now, what else have we got? Do you want to? Pick We've anything? got the uh, lunch clubs as well. Oh, it's yes. worth uh, always reminding ourselves of the wonderful provisions that we have uh, throughout the month. Um, Sunday lunch club and Wednesday lunch club. Uh, Sunday lunch club uh, always on the first Sunday of each month at twelve thirty in St Mildred's Church Hall. Um, so again, that's worth reminding us as the first Sunday of November uh, comes up. Uh, so do get in touch with Caroline in the office if you'd like to book on to Sunday Lunch Club. Um, and equally Wednesday Lunch Club, on the third Wednesday um, of each month, that means that when Lunch Club has just gone this, this month, is it? Uh, just gone on. Uh, wait a minute, where are we? Uh, so next club Wednesday. Oh Wednesday, yeah, just had that yeah, one. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. Sorry, just, yes, I'm just gone. Now. So we've got to wait yeah. the best bit of a month before uh, next Wednesday lunch club. Um, but do book on uh, with Mary if you'd like to come to that in November. Yeah. Now while the uh, Wednesday lunch club in November will be on the third Wednesday, which I think is the twentieth, uh, the one in December, a bit of advance mm. notice, will be a week earlier, i.e. on the second well, Wednesday because uh, otherwise it might clash with one or two other things going on. Uh, so uh, in December it'll be a week earlier. But we'll uh, remind you about that nearer the time. So apart from birthdays, I don't think there is anything else, is there? No, I think we've, I think we've done I think we've done very well, really. Yeah. Uh, and just prove, oh dear, it just proves that when we're left to our own devices, <laughs> uh, we can succeed. Sometimes. Yes. Now, if you do want to light a couple of candles, we've only got two birthdays uh, this week. Uh, one is uh, Scylla Mackenzie's birthday, and one is Sylvia Fernie's birthday. Now, Scylla celebrates her birthday this very day, and Sylvia has to hang on till Tuesday, when it will be her birthday. Um, and we're going to sing to the two of them. That's it. Okay, now get the banner at the ready. You get ready with prime, the, prime the banner. Yeah, you get ready with that middle candle. So I'll let it take some light today. Is it taking? Is it taking? Oh, there we are. Right. Okay. Are you ready? Just trying to get in the tune in harmony. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Scylla and Sylvia. Happy birthday to you. Very good. Um, 
the advantage of two names, of course, is you don't have to peer at the sheet here to try and remember them. That's all right. Uh, so that's good. Right. That's still going nicely. Lovely. Ah, excellent. Um, a bit more deep purple to finish off with, if I can find it. Here we are. We will see you soon. Uh, hopefully some of you tomorrow at church. And um, if not, around and about. Have a good Absolutely. weekend. Here we go. Hi everyone.